Bong. Holy crap. Hey guys, this is Isaac. This is Taryn. And we are Two, two Men and a Mic playing Dark Darksiders. I'm so excited. Part 5. Number 1, Part 5. Yes, yes. Darksiders <laughs> 1, Part 5. We haven't made 5 yet. That's our dream, though. That is our dream. That there will be a 5. I want to play that so bad. Because that will be all of them. Alright. The, the glory, glory and... Oh, I have to kill things with B. Ooh, you're giving me easy ones to start with. You're so nice. Beep, 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 beep. Beep, 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 beep. Mm. Uh, it's funny, so... <clears throat> those of you uh, who played Diablo, we, we mentioned the, the cursed chess things last couple times ago. And, uh... No, it was last time. Anyway. So, the during January, which is when this is being filmed, and when you're seeing this, Diablo 3 does a, a darkening of Tristan event, which is where they Aww. basically uh, do a sort of remake of the Diablo 1 that you can run through an adventure mode. It's actually really fun. And so I did that today, and it was it was a lot of fun, but then after that, I... Was it during that? I think it was during that. I don't oh. Wow. I forgot I'm on hard. Yeah, you're on, like, hardcore or whatever it is. Remember, you have to stun them to do B. You still have to beat them up to do B. There you go. Now you can be. Wah. Can't just grab these guys, they're buff. Apparently. Um, but I, I felt it again, I did the curse chest, I was like, come on, come on, <laughs> give me more people. Yeah. It was just, it was very hard. I was not happy with it at all. The only cursed chest that girlfriend and I did in that was one that it said kill all the enemies and it was literally a group of like eight enemies and that's it. That's the only one that was even available for us. Oh uh, really? Yeah. Yeah, I had to do I had to do one of those kill hundred within the time limit and I got eighty three. Oh, that sucks. And I promise, because of how quickly I killed them once they started coming, I would have got a hundred if it didn't start with like two, two and, and then, then three four and, and then, then yeah. yeah. Like, just give them all to me at once, please, please. No, I'm okay with this either. not giving them all to me at once. No, no, no. <laughs> How do I dodge? There we go. <laughs> I went on vacation for two weeks, okay? <laughs> oh, you're funny. I say, here's hoping you're immortal while you're in the air like that. Uh, in most cases, when you do a B attack, you're immortal. I am immortal. I have inside me blood of angels and demons. Yeah, yeah. I have no rival for war. Oh. Guess this is the first game of no one else exists. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> and I'm in the future of, so far, all of the other games. <laughs> yeah. And I would assume you're super in the future of Strife. Like, he just seems like he's... He's going to be the first one. He's going to be the first one. Like Whatever he did, one. he was doing already. So, for those who don't know, like, there's a, there's a very, ooh, oh, oh, healing crystals. And there's two of them. Ugh. Hey. <laughs> You're like, ignore them, hit the small guys. Ignore them, hit the small guys. No! Oh. I don't even know what I hit. You hit restart, but it was a close thing, I think. <laughs> <sighs> I only have to do two more. <laughs> well, so don't get punched. <laughs> just, just, just know that it is okay to punch people in the back of the head in this game. <laughs> Shut up! You don't even see that yet. It's tomorrow. You guys don't know what that it means. It's talking about until tomorrow. But save that joke in your mind, and you'll laugh tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> piece of crap. <laughs> anyway, stab. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I, I will admit, I think, one, you know, as, as we've said multiple times, um, Taryn and I love Blizzard as a company, mm -hmm. and I think they did a great job of... Oh, the Darkening of Tristram. The Darkening of Tristram thing. I think they did a great job of, you know, bringing back some of the nostalgia for those who played it, and at the same time, very much enjoyment for those who hadn't. So, Girlfriend and I ran through it before Taryn did. And they have not played one. And I have played one. I have never beaten one. Um, 
but I have played two and a lot of the similar things there. But it was super fun and great for me to see, feel all that nostalgia and see all of that. Um, and then for Girlfriend, she just enjoyed the retroness of it. It was kind of a, a new feel for a game we both enjoy. So it was a whole lot of fun for that. So, so in short, if you have Diablo, check the Darkening of Tristram thing out if you yeah. haven't. You know, just if you haven't played in a while, just go check it out. It's yeah. fun. Like literally, even if you don't really play it at all anymore and you just want to check that out, it's totally worth just running through it. You don't have to be a super high level. In fact, there's actually an achievement for starting a brand new character and running through just the Darkening of Tristram at level one with zero experience by the time you enter the portal. So it's great fun no matter what level you are um, and no matter what experience level you are. If you ever played any of the old ones, you'll get a, you'll, you'll get all oh, it filled them. You'll get a lot of enjoyment. Yeah. I didn't expect it to kill him. When did it ever not kill these smaller dudes? The only thing I've seen live through that are bosses and the flamey fist blue dudes. I mean, he's kind of a mini boss. Mini bossin. Quah. Mini boffins dies. Mini boffins. To, <laughs> to give you this victory. <laughs> uh, well, so we can't talk about it much because... As far you know, as I'm concerned, it's been out for like five weeks now. So, so, yeah, as far as you and I are concerned, as far as the internet's concerned, if it's like less than a year, we're demons. Well, no, that's we're just making spoilers. Facebook has officially basically become like, okay, if you haven't seen it by now, that's your own fault, and here are all of the memes. <laughs> there are so many... Kylo with his shirt off memes. Oh? Yeah. Like, what, what? Just that scene memefied into, like, different... I know, but I'm, I'm like, what? Are they making fun of him? Or be like, I'm sexy Kylo? It's like, kind of both. A little both. Okay. It, it, it's a mixture of both. Um, I will oh. say my favorite one, just because I'm a weirdo, is um, a mixture of the, of the, of the um, shirtless Kylo scene and the, oh my gosh! <laughs> One more time. Is a mixture of the shirtless Kylo scene and the um, blue milk scene with Luke on the island. Okay. So it's just a it's it's a comic strip. Uh, so somebody drew this, right. and uh, so they drew shirtless Kylo, and then they drew Luke taking blue milk out of one of shirtless Kylo's nipples and then uh, drinking it. That's good. Uh, I found it hilarious. Like, it's kind of funny, but it's mostly gross. It's, yeah. Oh, I got one. Oh, my God. <laughs> there are a I'm lot not, more. I'm not a fan. Um, all I was going to say was that I thoroughly enjoyed the movie. Um, it is getting severely mixed reviews in uh, on the internet. I'm not at all surprised. The internet doesn't know how to do anything else, first of all. Um, oh, I'm sorry, the it, look outside in the real world for, for a minute in the last few years has become increasingly what's a what's a not first word to say this? <laughs> whiny. Um, and the internet is all the bad parts of reality internet reviews and opinions yeah. are all the bad parts of reality condensed into a single entity. So yeah, I'm not surprised impossible to please everybody. It is impossible to please everybody. Right? It was impossible to please everybody ten years ago, and it's still impossible. Only now, every, only now everyone whines about it. Like it's a crime to not be able to please everybody. Even though by trying to please everybody, you make it worse. So, but it's like, no, we'll make it good. Yeah. Surprisingly good, in fact. I, I will say two of my other favorite memes from it were uh, Star Wars Episode Eight. Um, a movie about moving on and remo and forgetting the past for a fan base that can't move on and forget the past. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Oh my gosh! Stop it! Stop it now! And the seagulls no. poke your knees. Poke your knees. Yeah. Stop it now! Or somewhere now. Stop it now! Mm, uh, don't hit me. <laughs> Please. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, for those of you who haven't seen that, uh, that would be um, bad lip reading. Seagulls. Yoda seagulls. Uh, if you have not seen that, go enjoy it. It is fun. Yes. Um, 
But uh, an another meme from Star Wars was um, Star Wars Episode Seven. You didn't do. It's exactly like the old ones. It's too much change. There's not enough change. Blah blah blah. Episode Eight. There's too much change. Not enough like the pre <laughs> like the <laughs> originals. I think it's funny because I I only found. Uh, <coughs> oh. All right, we're gonna give this one more try on screen. Oh, yes. Uh, what was the thing? Oh, yeah. It, I I thought felt like the movie did a very good job of like doing its own thing. I only found uh, one amusing like sort of reference to the its equivalent in the previous film tr trilogies, mm -hmm. um, and I thought it was kind of funny. Uh, apparently, Dad though he went saw it. he didn't like it because he felt like there were far too many homages. Yeah, I'm that's just there, it. I'm sitting there going, I'm like, where? That's what I was gonna say. Is Dad fa thought that like the entirety of the um, uh, the scene where it's a trap. Kylo and Rey go to see spoilers? Go on. <laughs> Sorry. Yes, spoilers. Giant spoilers. You know what? We'll just have to put that in the title. No, because we haven't really spoiled anything so far. Shirtless, shirtless Kylo. Kylo. <laughs> you see a dude shirtless. I don't care. There is no... I cannot think of a single movie plot where that's spoilers for anything. <laughs> like, that's not a spoiler for porn, even. Which is the only thing I can think of where it could possibly be a spoiler. Like, that's the only thing where taking your shirt off is part of the plot of the show. <laughs> and... And it's not a spoiler. Okay, okay. so yes, a spoiler. It's sort, of like, it's sort of like any movie that involves a fight between good and evil. You know the shirt is going to come off in a point. And I've made this weird, so we're going to move <laughs> on to this point. It's very weird. Um, but so Kylo and Rey go up to meet Snoke, and Dad felt that the entirety of the dialogue for all of that was very reminiscent of Episode 6. Between Luke and Vader going to the Emperor? Yeah. It's like it's the same scene, and I'm like... No. I'm like, not really, but all right. It's like, yeah, no, it's one person trying to convert another person to not be an evil douche. Right. But, you know. I had a co-worker. Woo! Woo! I had a co-worker who was like, when when the end of that scene came, all he wanted was for Ray to go to the dark side. He's like, she doesn't have to stay that way for the whole, you know, series, but like, just do something different. I'm like, No! She's the good guy. Yeah, like that. It's like if this were a longer than three movie series and this weren't at the end of a second movie, uh, you know, maybe, maybe but you could swing it. But uh, as it turns out, no. Right you two, there. right there. Nope. <laughs> don't get greedy, don't get greedy, don't get greedy. Do it, do it, do it. Yes! Run, 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 run. Uh, 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 and it was all on screen. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, you guys got to see like 16 minutes of me doing that. Lock counter. Oh, it's about time. I remember that. Really? So there's a nuke. There's a, there's a use to doing that beyond just having to get through it. That's kind of neat. Shut up, Luke. We were just talking about you. <laughs> uh. <coughs> Heal me. No. All the healing. Now, are there any more of these? Or nope, that's it. That, that is actually the last one. So you can go to the door now. Oh, yeah. I should, yeah. I'll be the last of them. Let's get out of Let's here. Let's get out of here. We'll see you guys at the door. Yay! Yeah. I'm like, excuse me, open up, wake up, hey. <laughs> <laughs> wake up, wake up. I already did the shake up. Other things you must be okay with. All right, dwarf. Yeah, I love the makers. 
They're ten foot tall dwarves. Everything about them is dwarf, except they're like bigger than war here is. Ooh. With environmental weapon attacks. Ah. Uh -huh. well, I don't throw things at people. Nope. And you don't bash them with chairs enough because it really doesn't do enough damage, and I doubt it will even with that. Yeah, I agree. Oh, it up. I was like, crunch? Oh, no, it actually looked you. Oh, man. All right, time to see what's beyond the graveyard. Through the giant tunnel. Oh, my gosh. What is the purpose of this giant tunnel, do you think, originally? Loading. <laughs> <laughs> oh. This is a giant loading tunnel. That was better than any real answer. I was looking for, like, <laughs> in-world realistic, like, what is this tunnel for, do you think? You know, loading screen. Oh, it, or sorry, loading the, loading. Yeah. You know, to load the world. I'm like, that, yes. By the way, it's a road. Oh, that reminds me. See? You, you can see the, the yellow. No, I know, but the, the one over there wasn't. You were in a water tunnel. It was a round thing. Uh -huh. Don't go back. Well, I mean, hang on. No, because now back. I have to know. I guess it was sewage? Yeah, it's like a, but it's huge. It is huge. That's all. It's just it's freaking enormous. To be fair, I don't actually know how big sewer pipes are, but I wouldn't assume that they're the size of, like, our house. Yeah, they're not big enough you can get a giant garbage truck through them, that's for that's sure. Right. Ice. Yeah, I don't have a thing to break that yet. Flap. Flap. Murder. Now, the question is, do you land back on land? Or do you oh, yeah. No, I will. <laughs> oh, that was great. I love video games. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. So what are you looking at? I forgot to be looking for the owner. Oh, right. But anyway, yeah. We were talking about it, though. We were oh, talking yeah. about things. I just bet the loading was great. Anyway. So let's see. We're in. We've gone from a gigantic sewer pipe to a highway to more this. sewer <laughs> um beyond it uh, but even infested room so this is the first time we recorded in about two weeks because i was um on vacation with girlfriend um during that time we remembered christmas uh we forgot new year's we did. We did not discuss New Year's. So, Happy New Year's, guys. Happy belated New Year. It is 2018. Whoa. We've had videos with the 2018 before, but you know, 2018! This is the third official recorded video in, of 2018. Yes, the third video recorded. This will be the second video you guys see that was recorded in 2018. And it's like the, I don't know, 12th or something that's been, been out in 2018? Yeah. I don't know. I don't think it would be fun. I think this only makes like eight. I was because we had the whole first week. I, of this I was month. just yeah yeah January. yeah about eight. No, get back here! I want to jump on your bones. Nope. Nope. <laughs> I'm like really. Nope. <laughs> Sigh. What did you just walk into? I don't what is this place? Um, you just hit the map and show me. It's broken it's stair. Broken okay. stair. That is not a stair. That's not stair. How you spell. That is not how you spell stair, is stair it? Stair as in stairs. S T A I R. Yes, as in stairs that you walk up. That's how you spell stair. Stairs that I'm looking at you is S T A R E. Hmm. But stair as in stairs that one walks upon. Yes, it's S T A I R. I don't English good. Oh, that sentence was great. <laughs> oh. Uh, you English oh. fine. You don't do that on purpose. I don't spell well. Oh, uh, yeah. But that's okay. That took that took work and a lot of playing Legend of Zelda. I'm sorry, what? That's how I learned to read, dude. <laughs> playing Legend of Zelda? Yeah. I mean, I, I get that. I learned the rules of English by reading, not by English class. No, that's just it. Mo like, so for you, you guys, obviously don't know this, but I, uh, I didn't do, I didn't do well in school, not because I didn't want it down here. Oh, hey, Fulgrim. Uh Not because I didn't. Um, I was bored. School was boring, and I didn't like English. I was bad at it. 
Um, so I ended up like not going for almost three years straight until I finally got my act together and graduated. Um, but during that three years... It took effort at that point, so young people listening, just do it the normal way. It's a lot easier. Oh my gosh, it's so much easier. Don't, don't, don't skip school. It's so much harder to Everything. graduate after three years of not going. It's, yeah, that was a lot of work. Um, but so I, uh, hello, Vogram. Um, um, so yeah, three years of no school. But so during that time was when I really started to actually be able to speak and articulate online well. Um, and that was because I was playing video games and reading them. And uh, because I went on to roleplay forms, um, like fantasy and stuff that were text-based. And that's when I really started to learn how to write and read. Still can't spell perfectly. You know, I have issues. Which I'm sure some of you have noticed in the titles of our videos. Um, I try to catch them, <laughs> uh, and mostly he does well, so it's cool. Okay, that was cool. That's one of the abilities I just got. Baseball, <laughs> baseball swung that guy to pieces. It also lights him on fire, which is cool. I killed him with a chair. I saw that. <laughs> Um, but yeah, that that was one of the biggest reasons mom became okay with video games was because they actually were helping me to function in reality. So, so there you go, guys. As long as your videos are text-based, get your parents to let you play. <laughs> <laughs> if it's all talking, well, it's all shut up. Learn to read. <laughs> Learn to read, kids. It's helpful. That's just cool. It is fun. <laughs> Well, no, I, I was not the same thing at all, but a similar sort of didn't learn English linguistics from school as much as it was from organically figuring it out via reading. And I discovered this. I, I was not a big reader till about third grade, and my... Uh, oh, what? Life. Oh, that's, that's a life upgrade thing, right? Yeah. Is that... You have two now, right? Yeah. Two more. Oh god, I'm definitely gonna get a car one shot. Wow, that's the other one you got. That's mm -hmm. fun. Um, but I, I despised reading up until about the third grade. My mother and parents and grandparents were really seriously trying to get us to read. And yeah. finally I was given a book that I actually liked, and there's more on that later. But Started, started reading a lot after that. I'm like, oh, books can actually be interesting and not boring and dull and textbook and garbage and blah. <laughs> um, so I started reading a lot, and I became very good at English, as you do if you read often and read quality. Um, and I'm not. I'm trying not to be book snobbish about that, but just things that have actual decent writing in them, as opposed to you know. This is Ben. He went to the market, you know. Well, I mean, that's that, a that kid's was an, book. That was an over, oversimplification, but you get the idea. So is he going to break everything on his way to you, or do you actually have to sit here and fight him? I'm not, I'm not uh, sure. He, he got rid of all of my fly things, so... Oh! So you're not going that way! He got you're, rid of my you're fly running away. that way, too. So I have to wait. Are you sure? Because I think you're supposed to go to the right. Taryn, there was a fly thing here. You can make that jump! No, I can't! He is going to kill you. He's not going to kill uh, just me. Just so you know. I feel like this is the game going, uh, you're supposed to run from this thing because you don't have the power yet. We'll see who's right. Reflect! Oh, right. I have a guard block. That's what that was probably supposed to be. Oh, well. All right. Time to kill him. Oh, okay. <laughs> there, guys. We will see you and talk more about reading next time. Thank you so much for joining us. As always, leave comments as to what you want to see slash here slash... I don't know, do? I don't know, you want to hang out sometime? I don't know, let us know. <laughs> In the meantime, this has been Two Men and a Mic, signing, signing off. off. <laughs>
Hey guys, you can click the link in the left for our last lore video. You can click the link on the right for our last Let's Play. And right here, in the middle, that orb, you can hit that to, to subscribe. subscribe. Also, ring the bell if you want to be notified when we post a new video. This, this is Two Men and a Mic. Thanks for watching. watching.